a heavy weight scored impressions in the ground one inch deep. Impressive. <laughs> Hello friends and welcome back to Sherlock Holmes The Awakened. This week we're in the bayou and it seems all very spooky scary. Um, I have the game paused right now because when I loaded in it started off with uh, Watson asking Holmes Do you think the sheriff was right? Uh, that he means what he says? That we won't escape? Uh, and that's where we've got to so I'm just gonna unpause the game now and we'll hear what Sherlock Holmes has to say. Escape? One cannot be hurt by superstition, Watson. This hut has been abandoned for a long time. It reeks of damp. We are more likely to sink in there than on our boat. Let's go. All right. So yeah, we got a we got a gun now. Last week, Holmes was ready to shoot the sheriff, saying, uh, "I won't let a case go cold on my watch," which was pretty pretty wild. So wait, are we getting in the boat? Because it says use wazd. Oh, we are. Okay. But. Okay, that's fine. But we ended. It doesn't matter. No! Ah! A box has jumped out at us. Look, Holmes! Fireflies! Oh, well, I'm glad you're still having fun. I want so badly to believe that the old ones can't hurt me. Hmm, I'm not entirely sure where I'm going. I'm reminded simultaneously of uh, God of War and Hellblade. Ooh, a white X. Oh, there's the... Follow death messengers, then pass through fire without fear. After the bleeding willow, chase the crows. Avoid any crosses that appear. L Lucy said death messengers are white lilies. Don't worry, Mr. Arneson, we're coming. As soon as we find the flowers and then unravel the other cryptic stuff. It was on the note. Hey, what is a death How did this shipwreck get here? Let us just ensure we do not end up the same way. Well, we're getting new voice lines, and the game just auto saved, so I think that's a good sign. If I could row a boat this fast in a suit, well, then a lot, many things about my life would have to be different, but it's impressive, is what I'm trying to say. Is this a new hut? Have we come back to the same hut? New hut. I think. L skip. What? Oh, okay. Skip tutorial bit. Okay. Thought it was going to be an option to skip the entire section of this video game, which would have been a bold choice. Must have arms like pythons. We're honing it around this one. Hello. Death messengers, please. There's a light on in there. That's interesting. No idea if we're going the right way. Oh! <gasps> are you death messengers? Well, there are no more of them. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck! Oh! What was that, Holmes? Whatever, or whoever it was, we should ready ourselves. That scared the shit out of me. Oh, spooky, scary swamp. Ah, fire without fear. So these are the death messengers. Pass through fire without fear. OK, 
Okay. After the bleeding willow, chase the crows. Avoid any crosses that appear. Uh, Am I hearing drums? Drums in the bio? Drums in the deep. Well, that's a wheel in a tree. Oh, maybe it's a bleeding wheelow. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just threw fire without fear. Holmes, I, I think I heard something swim underneath our boat. Probably just a rotten log. Rotten logs don't swim. The doctor was very clear about his verbiage there. Did you hear that, Holmes? What do you see? A shadow. Nothing more. Okay. Are we sure about that? That's a cross that's appeared. Does that mean we have to turn back? I think it might be. Fire without fear. Fire without fear. And avoid the crosses. Does that mean we should go the other way? It's all very foggy and drummy and horrible. Was that a severed arm? No. God, I'm getting... I'm getting spooks now. I'm not seeing any more fire. Which is troublesome. Oh, there's some. And here's some. Hmm. Oh, there's quite a lot more. But if we start seeing crosses, we must double back. I think we've gone in a big loop. Yes. You know what? Let's try... No, let's, let's go back. So we're avoiding any crosses that appear. And passing through fire without fear. Not seeing any torches, but also not seeing any crosses. That's new. That thing hanging in the tree. Oh, here's a torch. So, oh fucking hell! That's a lot. That's a big old fire there. Oh no, we've just come full. We come full circle. Seems pretty promising. That's clearly a gate guiding us in, isn't it? Oh, that's a cross. Turn around. Another torch. Another. Oh, we're back by the. Okay. Back by here, are we? Another torch. Another torch. This is all very promising. Okay, all right. This this feels like a good path. And by good path, I mean it's all very 
fucking creepy. That's the shore, Johnny. So we won't go that way. Oh, there's a torch. Okay. If you told me when I binned your paper that we'd end up fleeing the law in a rowboat through the Louisiana Bayou, I dare say you would have hardly been surprised. Touche. It is pretty weird, though. All right. That was a nice callback, though. I enjoyed that. Yeah, I think if it weren't for Sherlock Holmes, there's no way anyone would have found Anderson ever again. Must be a lot of work to keep these uh, torches lit as well, I have to say. There must be people out here all the time replacing. Hair is getting thicker, almost suffocating. The stench of death. All too familiar now. God. Well, that doesn't sound good at all. Ooh, hello. Ooh, hello. Weeks of death. We're more likely to sink in there than on our boat. Let's go. Oh, okay. All right, well. Oh, no, there are more torches. Okay. I thought that... Careful of the gators, Watson. It is stupidity rather than courage to refuse to recognize danger when it is... Jesus Christ. What? Brain food? Feed yourself to a gator? Well, I just got Sherlock Holmes killed, everybody. Sorry about that. We're more likely to sink in there than on our boat terms. Let's go. Okay. How to avoid gatters. Maybe we just don't go this way at all. I think we don't go this way at all. I think we go uh, this way. Yeah, so far we've not been eaten, so that's good. It's important to check these things, though, you know? More likely to sink here than on our boat. I oh, know, we're fine. Okay. What is that noise? I don't love this. Ah, this will be the bleeding willow Holmes, then. Hand me the rifle. I can shoot the ropes holding a few of those poor souls. Come on, Holmes, give me the rifle. Watson, stay calm, but be quick. An alligator has noticed us. Okay. Oh, oh, I think we're doing this to distract the gators? That's, that's vicious. That's nature, Watson. Let's try not to annoy them. Sign of answer. If not, let's push on. Oh, okay. Yeah, all right. That was a unique puzzle, wasn't it? Feed the corpses to the gators. Then go past the gators. Well, I suppose it's not that. That's it. We've, we've done this before with a pig and some rats. If you've watched a previous series of Press Any Kidini, it doesn't feel good either way. Well, and I guess we've done it with Dishonored 2 and some humans. Yeah. Oh, I hope I got all of them. Oh, that's a dead bird. Okay. Ah, here we go. Uh, 
Do 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 do. Chase the crows. Oh. Uh, no, we're not going to keep that pinned. That's taking up most of the fucking uh, screen. We'll just follow the crows by looking at the crows. How about that? There's a crow. There's a crow. This is elaborate. This is very elaborate. Plenty more crows. There's a crow. There's a torch and a crow. That pier looks promising over there, Watson. All right, great. We're approaching the heart of darkness. <laughs> all right, that's a... Yep, yeah, all right. Hooray, land This place home. gives me the shivers. Despite the muggy night. Ooh. To Everdance. Okay. La la la. We've got to find him. Clues for navigation. Okay. No, wait. We've already done this bit. Should be should be this island. Right. Okay. Fine. It is crucial we find and save him. Jeepers creepers. All right. What we got? More blood. Untended wound. Still alive. Same boot princess from the mansion. Ashmack dragged Arneson here. Okay. But those boot prints were heading back this way. Oh, wait, but... Oh, no. Oh, he's going backwards. Because he's dragging him. That makes a whole lot more sense than we just miss them. <laughs> Pass them on the way. Bleed in hell. Okay. Ooh, this is sinister. Ash, mate, you're a piece of work, mate. Okay, that looks very bad for me. And Ashmat. Not Ashmat, Arneson. Ashmat seems kind of in on this. Oh, the smell of burning flesh just horrific bare feet erratic movement so we may soon leave all this behind passions and deception dang burning people alive is it that looks like some sort of old one hey how about that bloodied handprint four blood drips the hand tied here was bleeding in four places this had to have been honest oh no Oh no. It was tied upside down. Okay, what we got? What we got? The bloody handprint on this stone lacks four fingers. Okay. The victim's left hand clawed at the soil. Definitely honest, isn't it? Sunken heels, the result of dragging a heavy body. Right. Okay, so he's not been burned alive. What's in the old... Yep. Anderson's photo. Fine. Why is it pinging the symbol up the top if there's nothing to answer in the Mind Palace? No, let's not pin his photo. Right. Around the bonfire there are dreadful crosses. Indeed. But we know he's been dragged this way. Ah, that's why. Look. We're at a... We're at a do the things thing. Let's go have a look here. That's interesting. The tracks lead behind the stone slab. Scratches from friction. Only this indentation was spared from blood. Which means there was something in here when... Oof. 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 
Mm, no, I think there was something else in there. There we go. That's more likely. But if we have learned anything, anything at all, from previous adventures with Sherlock Holmes, it's that we need all of the data before we can... Uh, I mean, that looks more likely. But we need to fulfill every single one of these before we can really put together the puzzle. We're, I'm not going to hit that validate button until I know. A heavy weight scored impressions in the ground one inch deep. Impressive. <laughs> God. Okay, what is that? Are they entrails? Days old and rotten. Okay, days old and rotten. Oh, what's that? Damp and mouldy hay. The prisoners were kept like animals, slowly deteriorating under the gruesome treatment. Okay. Well. The initials EA are embroidered with silk thread. I dare say that's Arneson's. The prisoners' clothes tossed aside. Okay. So, what can we see here? Any anything next? No. That's an axe. It's a bloody axe. The blood is dry. The axe has not been used for some time. Well, that's comforting. A simple rope. Is swamp cypress ah, endemic to the area? That's what the dragon This is how those from. poor people were crucified. Yes. Yeah, it does rather make sense, doesn't it? Well, bleeding heck. Ah, fun. Or. No, it's definitely how they were crucified. <laughs> Okay. Uh, what else have we got? Let's find more horrible things to look at, shall we? Wait, what's this? Have we looked at this? Yes, we have. Ah, uh, it'll probably be the altar, hey? Yes, that looks about likely. Ah. Blood was poured over someone, leaving a gruesome silhouette. Oh, look at that. Yeah, horrible. Partial handprint, thumb only. So I'm guessing that's Arneson. Bowls filled with blood. Blood Bowl, my favourite game. <laughs> oh, dear. Wait, hang on a minute. I heard the little sniffy noise. Oh no, that was on the balls of blood, wasn't it? The knife? Yes, the knife. A worn blade, but clean and without blood. Interesting. Oops. No. No. That. Yes. Fairly sure it's that. And over here... I'm fairly confident about this one. That that's where... yeah. Which is the one where I miss... Because one of them, the one on the left is the one I'm missing. Which 
I think is this one. Let's have a double look. Double look? A du let's double check. Let's have another look. No. No, it's not that one. Where's that first one, then? Is it the fire? Ah! Oof. I'm not going to hit validate. Okay, I've left the area. So it is here. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I didn't even see there are people still up there. Right. Oh, it's this, isn't it? Okay. But what else am I missing from around here? Oh! Whoa. Aha! I didn't take a close enough look at this. That's a lot of blood, but probably not enough to be fatal. Useful. Good. Encouraging. The rope was cut. Both ends of the rope were cut cleanly. Okay. Captive was dragged through hell. Okay. But that gives me all three. What's this new one say? No! <laughs> I think I've got it, to be honest with you. That's Arneson which is a pretty good indicator. There's something there in the niche. Let's double check this one. Because ideally we want it to be Arneson in there. There we go, that's better. And then we know we've got Arneson here and here. I reckon we got it. Let's try. Ooh. Arneson was held captive in this cage until his abductors tied him to a cross and dragged him to the bonfire. Arneson was left hanging here for a while before being freed and led to the altar. At the altar, Arneson's captors performed a ritual on him and poured blood over his head. With Arneson now prepared, he was escorted to the sealed entrance. Mm. They used the mechanism with an indentation to open the passage. Okay, good. Let's talk again of finding the passage. But what do we do now? Now that we know this. Okay. The indentations... The indentation internals had an object inside. It must be covered in blood. We must find the thing of me. But where is the thing of me? If I were a cultist pouring blood on people in the woods and splashing blood on a thing of me to open a door, where would I keep? the thing of me. I should be glad we're out of the water, but I'm not. Yes. That's fair. Excuse me, mate. Where'd you keep your, uh, your thing of me? Hey, what is this? Uh, nope. Okay. Yeah, we've sort of seen all of that. Hmm. Let's go back over to the door. Okay, so loads of blood. Blah, blah, blah. There's blood here. Was that there before? Can we follow this? Oh, oh, ah, oh, ha, ha. 
the thingamy. Heavy and covered in blood. Great. We don't have to re-wet it then. For such an elaborate doorway, they didn't keep, really didn't keep that well hidden at all. Okay, well this this is worrying. All right, yeah, I think I've I think I've seen more than enough of this place. Something is wrong with my lantern. Give me a minute. Shh. I won't wait for you. I'm going in. What? What? Why? What? Why? Why would you do that? I won't wait for you. I'm going in. Mm -hmm. You're in so much danger, Holmes. I mean, I know they need to split you up so we can go through another ruggy buggy horrible bit. But come on. <sighs> oh. Whoa, the tide those who take it. Walk away. Let the unknown be. But what if? Oh no. That's human skin and still warm. Ah, what's happening? I was warned, in fairness. Oh. Sherlock and his technicolor dream scenario. I close my eyes. Deja vu and not in a pleasant way. Oh, no, it's not nice being here again at all. Don't go that way. Oh, bollocks. Nope. Oh, we won't go that way either. That's a shipwreck. I can also hear something thudding about. Is this meant to be Rilech? Or whatever it's called. Ah, Rilech. Don't want to be here right now. Oh, don't go off the... That's a big horrible thing up there, look. That's a big hand over there, look. Stairs go down. These stairs go up. Okay, that's no, that also seems quite dead endy. All right. Why did we read the book, eh? I won't wait for you, I'm going inside. Smash cut to Sherlock Holmes tripping balls. Ooh, what's that over there? Oh, it's just the... It's the fire bowl. The... Brazier. Yeah. <laughs> Still suspicious of that word. So last time we had like perspective puzzles and some plates and also at one point we just had to lob ourselves off a thing. Nope, I thought that hand might catch us, but no. And there's this sort of mirror. Oh, there we go. Right, yeah, we're back. We're back with the perspective puzzles. Now if memory serves, you follow the noise until you reach the plate. Very good. 
then that becomes a solid thing that we're able to walk on. No, it isn't. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait. Hang on a minute. Hang a bat. We've got to go back. And make the theoretical bridge a real bridge. Wait, no. Where's my theoretical bridge gone? Where's the... Where's the... Hmm. Yeah, it is meant to just be there, isn't it? With the end. Alright, well there must be something else for us to activate to actually... Ah, look, listen. Well, it got louder, but... I can hear it. I can't see it. Maybe I need to drop down onto it? No. Stop falling off the things. Maybe it's down. There we are. That seems more likely. There we go. Oh yeah, there it is. Okay. Because the thing about sound, right, is it can travel up as well as down. There you go. This reflection of homes is really weird. It keeps... Oh, it's because I'm seeing the back of myself and it's like distorted. I, I thought he was in a cultist robe. But I'm not. Why? Why? It worked now? Ta-da! Where's the... Th What's the third bit? How make step real? Please? Of course, the real Sherlock Holmes didn't have the... the luxury of trial and error. Am I meant to walk it? Because that was a thing last time as well, wasn't it? Or am I just meant to remember this route? Let's go back through and try. Nope. I'm sorry, Holmes. Oh, no, don't go that way. Go through the mirror. Oh, did I actually go off the right bit then? Hang on. Can't believe we're just doing this repeatedly until. Blah, blah. There we bloody go. Ah, oh, this is some Max Payne one. L lengthy memory bullshit. Okay. All right. Da -da. Left? Left? Oh, come off it. Left? Left? Right? Oh, fuck's sake. Right, let's have a peek. Let's have a peek through the solution door. Right, so we go right. Oh, it does go right. And it continues up. There's a faff in it. Oh, fuck off. Really? I like the puzzle, but... The consequences for getting it wrong. You just it's a long reset to check your working, isn't it? Right, okay. Well we can do this though. Clump, 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 fuck. 
Okay, sorry. Let's try that again. Maybe we won't run. Clump, 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 clump. No, we do go through the thumb. Oh dear. This goes on much longer. I'm going to start taking photos on my phone of the route. Yeah, fuck this. Oh, for God's sake, is it flipped? When yet? It is flipped. Is it? So we go right, and we go round, and we go up. Oh, I'm actually on the thumb now. Well, that's very bad. Get back on the thing. Okay, that's fine. Oh, my God. Three hours later. Goes up, I think. Fuck. Did you? Son of a bitch. Okay, so we go round this pillar. Go round this. We go. Oh, we go this way, don't we? This way, this way, this way. Oh, fuck! <laughs> Safe to say we're giving Holmes a lot of psychic damage right now. Do we go round? Fuck! <laughs> Ugh. Oh, twat. At least we're getting better at the first bloody bit. Zoom. Alright, out this way a little bit. And then this way a little bit. And then I think this way a little bit. Fuck it. Hello. Right. Fuck that puzzle forever. I never want to do it again. Wow, I hated that. And now, axes? Oh, for fuck. What's on earth for? Oh, to piss me off. Did you? Left that one a bit late, but we got there. Well, we're just going to end up back at the start. Maybe we have to go. Whoopsie! Whoopsie Daisy! Oh look! Now it is glowing. But why? Oh, because I deep scratches, dry blood. Do I have to get? Do I have to get cut up three times? I think I might do. Really? Oh no! Well, I advanced at least. No, is that the bucket? No. Well, this is rubs. <laughs> so, not this one. Ah, look. Yeah, there are symbols on each. So, I've got to feed myself to the one with the palm tree man going like, Weehee! The one that's someone in a cowboy stance. With a big Y on their head. Alright. So it's not this one. 
Fuck this one. No! Oh, that one I just didn't get past. Sorry about the Sherlock. Not exactly piloting you expertly here, am I? Woo hey! Now, this one we do need to feed ourselves to. John! <laughs> what? Yes, there we go. And then. There's that glow again. Oh, there's that glow again. I've been hit by a massive axe. There's that glow again. Not this one. Yes to this one. Let's go head button axe. There we go. Ta-da. I hope that was all. I can't take any more. You'd be surprised, actually, Holmes. You took several more than you, there than you needed to. At last, the lantern's working again. Holmes, I'm coming. Holmes, I'm coming. Fantastic. Oh, dear. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Holmes, what are you doing, sitting in a place like this? How did you get here? How did you get through the maze? Tell me, Watson. What maze? I walked straight up to you. You saw me. Uh -oh. Do not lie to me, John. Oh, no. How did you get out? Oh, no. Sherlock, what happened? Are you feeling all... Oh, heavens. Is that Arneson? Why didn't you mention him? Stay put. I must check if he is alive. Oh, dear. Arneson, my... The own. unknown. Oh, God. Beckoning. Great one. Lightning. I should examine him before he has another seizure. He's alive, all right. Okie dokie, missing some fingers. Severed fingers, the wounds are inflamed. Yes, they'll be infected by now, I have no doubt. Blunt trauma to the cranium, dilated pupils, lips moving without a sound. Tremendous. Cold sweat. Two, no, three ribs fractured. Pulse is racing, 110 beats a minute. Arneson is delirious after all he's endured. Fair. We can't get into the boat in a state like that. It's dangerous to us and him. Okay. How can Arneson be sedated? Uh, 20, 20, 20 years to go. Please tell me there are no eels inside Arneson. Oh, good God. Let me forget. Please let me forget. What have we got here? Pokeweed berries, though they appear harmless, the whole plant is lethal. Oh, Christ. Mushrooms. Some kind of Amanita mushroom. Extremely poisonous. Extremely poisonous. Pharmacopoeia. Listing drugs, effects, and directions for use. Pharmacist Handbook, How to Treat Without Killing. This book is a helpful assistant on your journey to becoming a competent pharmacist. Every drop, crumble, or grain of a substance can bring a sick patient back to life, but may kill him if dispensed carelessly. It is crucial to know what can help and what can kill. Each chapter provides a brief description of every substance used in pharmacy. Remember, be precise, be patient, learn from the mistakes of others. Well, let's look up this last thing, and then we'll search it in the archive, which is something we learned how to do last time, isn't it? Odorless, watery, and hard to identify. It's piss. Okie dokie. Ah, here we go. Search this in the archives. Transparent liquid. Type. Oh, hang on. Identified liquid among other toxins. Odorless, watery, and transparent yellow. Liquid, odorless, color, luminescent, search, type, poison, it's definitely a poison. Homeopathy, medit. Light color. There we go, snake venom. Snake venom typically looks like yellow water. You can see why I thought it was luminescent though. 
It has no impurities or foam. A few drops of snake venom diluted or mixed with other substances can be used as a muscle relaxant. One drop per 80 pounds should be enough. Right then. How can Armisen be sedated? Pharmacist's handbook. No, not that. Okay, so it is snake venom. It must just be the pharmacist. No, it's not the pharmacist's handbook. How do we actually get it to show up? That it's the pharmacist's handbook. Yada yada yada. We searched it. Snake venom. And it's not gonna be the mushrooms in the and we berries, is it? What does this have like? How many mushrooms? Oh, since first day. Okay, oh okay, so the the information we need from snake venom is now there. So Arneson can be a snake venom and an item. I mean, it's not going to be the pokeweed berries. Or the, well, I mean, we can try it. Uh, the pokeweed berries, just in case. No, see, it's not that. Okay. Arneson's path? No. Stop trying to brute force this, Johnny. There must be something else out here. Oh, it'll be something like, I found a syringe. <laughs> yes, look. <laughs> Silly. Look at that. This is Dwale. Induces sleep and relaxation. Oh, that sounds good. A gluey decoction. The smell is herby but sharp. It appears burnt, judging by the color. <laughs> Salvia divinorum. Provokes visual hallucinations. Oh, blimey. All right. <laughs> yeah, we could try giving him some bloody salvia. Why not? What's this now? Hard to tell what it says. Okay. Oh, there's loads of stuff to look at there. Ah! Oh, fucking hell, Holmes. Rejoice for he is coming. Move worthy by giving life. Yeah, yeah. I just need a second to try. Alright, well, playing that record should help. Right, let's try it with the salvia, shall we? Snake venom. Oh, and dwell, probably. There we go. Make him sleepy, make him relax. Like a mining ingredients. Okay. We've got it. Let's sedate him. <laughs> I know, buddy, I know. This should help soothe us. <laughs> yeah, he's having a real bad time. I need some fresh air. Yes, please go. I'll be right behind you with Arneson. Perhaps you can prepare the boat. Really shouldn't be splitting up, the two of you. You've never been in more danger, and you've never been more like, Yeah, alright, you go on ahead. Without purpose, I now see the truth. Tear me mind from my flesh, scorn me festering soul. Phantoms of nothing, we are born to die. Built in the eyes of our eldritch lord. 
free my festering soul and let me feel. Uh oh. oh please, I wish to return. Free me, let me return. Free me and rejoice. I is without no purpose. I now no see the, the truth. Oh no. Tear no. my mind no. from no. my flesh. Holmes, are you all right? Here, let me help. I'm fine. Holmes? Sherlock! What the hell were you doing? He almost killed you! I don't... You're right. Let's go, Watson. Well, that was very troubling. But we got Arneson, which I did not think we'd do. Will the sheriff let us live? He thinks we're already dead. Bon Dieu! Still among the living! Hello! We are, though not for lack of trying by the sheriff. Well, he'd been telling people you died in the swamp despite his trying to save you. <laughs> Crooked man. Through and through. Wait, is that Mr. Arneson? Yes, but he's not well. You know Lucy? Fell from the nymph? That I do. Please bring her here. Mr. Arneson needs to see a familiar face if he's to have any chance of surviving. Airing his dirty laundry there. Power of the heart. I get you. Wait here. I mean, at least champagne's on the level. She's pretty cool. Uh, Errol? Oh, Errol! Reckon we should give him space. Farewells are painful. Whoa! No, what? no, 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 no. Tell me that's not true. Oh, is Watson? he gonna die? Mr. Arneson has endured a lot. Lost four fingers, a lot of blood, and some of his sanity. But with rest and tender care, he ought to survive those injuries, both physical and mental. All right. Thank you, Johnny. I'll take care of him. Thank you for bringing him home to me. We'll be all right. Are you quite certain? Do you have the space, the resources? I will stay with him at the mansion. It is not a burden to take care of your love. His property is in quite a state. It may not be the best place for recuperation. Hush now. Champagne will see it sorted. Yes. And then it's settled. Hear that, Errol? Us living under one roof. Careful what you wish for. Oh, and Champagne? I'm about sick of watching that sheriff run riot through New Orleans. We ought to talk. Bunny, I was just thinking that Grog did nothing to save your man. Together, I reckon you, me, and Errol have the sway to make some changes around here. Well, well. I like the sound of that. Mm -hmm. Holmes, our boat. Oh. We must make haste. Farewell all. Take care. All right, bye. Damn, nailed it. Oh, no. Oh, just leave it. Just leave it, Holmes. It's fine. Well, now. Who's there? Uh-oh. Ah, fuck. Who do you think? Let it be known that I'm handy with this revolver. Nonsense, Dr. Watson. As I understand it, when faced with the imperative to defend oneself, one's comrades, and one's nation, you fled. Oh, shoot him. I... Aren't you going to introduce us, Sherlock? Watson, meet my brother, Mycroft. Oh, for fuck's Queen's sake. best boy. This is a grim augury indeed, for wherever Mycroft travels, tedium surely follows. In contrast, of course, to Sherlock, a man whose obsessive pursuit of the trivial tears through the most carefully laid plans like a hurricane. Do you have any idea what you have disrupted? <laughs> your ego is inflated as much as your waistband. What word comes to mind? Oh. You, you work for the government? International trade is a delicate beast. Your antics and Edelweiss have jeopardized one of the Crown's richest relationships. Well, oh dear. As rich as all the butter you've been slathering on your bread? Sherlock. We need your help. What? There is evil afoot. Strangeness and savagery like I have never seen. Something otherworldly festering in the dark beyond our reach. We have seen things that defy explanation. Mystic forces, magic. You must help us. It's true. British government does not invest its resources in the insane or intoxicated. Pull yourself together. I know men like you. 
Men like you grease palms, whisper in ears, start wars, and you send men like me to die in them. Hell yeah. And the Hell rest yeah, Watson. Corpulent cronies. Ha! Corpulent! That was it. Interesting, Sherlock. But as you again drift away from sanity, you find yourself another John. What? All right, so the choice is made. I beg your pardon? There is only us. We cannot run from this problem. I shall take the book and Davis' cryptic message to Barnes. See what he makes of it. Hmm? I knew that was going to come in handy. Oh, give him some cocaine. He loves it. He'll be right back on his feet. Sherlock Holmes needs a bloody nap. Oh, or to play the violin. Sure, why not? Okay, well, we're back in very rainy London. Uh, and Sherlock has seen better days. It, uh, it seems to me. Um, and I've seen better puzzles than that invisible pathway. But there we go. We got through it in the end. And we stand now at the start of Chapter 7. Which we will push through next week on Sherlock Holmes The Awakened. Thank you very much for joining me for this episode of Press Any Chiedini. It has been really good fun. Apart from that brief period when it wasn't. Um, as ever, I have a Patreon. Uh, if you are able and willing... Uh, to support me directly through that it really does make a difference um but mostly i just hope you enjoyed this episode there's loads more stuff on the channel for you to watch um past series of Preston Kiedini. there are many 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 of them now so uh do check them out and have a look and i uh, hope you enjoy them um but yeah really i hope you enjoyed this episode and there remains nothing else to say other than thank you very much for watching and have a lovely day goodbye <laughs>